Hi y'all, welcome back to another episode of In the Kitchen at Ultimate Acres. I'm Kim. Today we are making sugar-free peanut butter. I will be using roasted peanuts with sea salt. They have four total carbs, three of which are dietary fiber, so one net carb for about 28 grams, about a quarter of a cup, which will be probably two tablespoons once it's made into peanut butter. I will also be adding some pure cane sugar substitute, which is four grams erythritol, zero calories, and zero net carbs. This peanut butter will not be quite as thick as store-bought peanut butter. The reason is store-bought peanut butter removes the healthy peanut oil that is liquid at room temperature and replaces it with hydrogenated oils that are more solid at room temperature. Also, there are no preservatives in this peanut butter. I refrigerate my homemade peanut butter as it helps solidify the oils a bit and to help prevent separation, the oil rising to the top requiring you to stir it before use, and it extends the life of natural peanut butter. Let's make peanut butter! I like my peanut butter to have a sweet and salty flavor, so I have found two tablespoons of pure cane is good with these sea salt peanuts, but you may need to adjust the amount for your preferred taste. Put the peanuts in the blender, add the pure cane, and start blending. stop it for just a little bit to scrape the little bit that's on the edge to get it in to blend up. So let's take it off.
You can blend it to your desired consistency if you like it a little smoother or if you like it a little crunchier. But homemade peanut butter. Have a great day, everyone.